Hey Leo, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a love reading for the sign of Leo. So if you're a Leo Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, or if you have a stellium in Leo, this reading is going to be for you. Keep in mind, this is going to be a general reading, so it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, let it fly. Don't try to force the message. Also, don't let this reading take anything from you. very very stuck in like whatever didn't work out in the past whatever happened in the past together these both cards seem like the five of cups energy these these are the this card is the three cups spilled whereas this are this is the two cups that are left behind but this person can't see it you are right now seeing at the bigger picture seeing at the brighter side you can see that you are healing from this this is that energy of you are healing from this connection you are you are focusing on yourself you are growing whereas this person is still holding on to that resentment and anger this person's growth is stunted, whereas you are growing. This might person might also feel like they don't have your attention anymore. Your attention is focused on someplace else, someone else. But this person's attitude, this person's bitterness is the reason there's delay in this connection. But for this person, the fire is still burning. The, they still have that passion. It's also very possible this person can't find that intimacy they found with you. They can't replicate it with someone else. And that is why they are being a bit bitter. They are being a bit resentful. They might also see you as someone who is having, who is doing fine, who is growing who's taking risks, who's moving on, who's moving ahead in life, whereas they are stuck in a, in a loop. They are stuck in a point of time. They can't move on. They can't move forward. They can't move ahead. Fortune. 
this person wasn't ready to take some risks here like this they had to take some risks they had to make some move for this connection to move forward for this connection to grow they had to do something about this connection but with the moon here this person was very insecure they were not sure for some of you this person could have had a lot of secrets and they were stuck in this third party situation because of which this person couldn't make that move we have 10 of pentacles and 10 of swords so 10 10 10 and this is your card yeah see this is that energy of them seeing you as this nine of pentacles this is what i said with the free spirited adventure uh, self growth soul finding self focused you are focused on yourself you are being this nine of pentacles energy and this person has they have an eye on you they are keeping tabs on you and the more this person sees you as this nine of pentacles energy the more they see you as the sun and the nine of pentacles the more they realize you are happy you're good you're doing well whereas they they can't move forward this person might have with the wheel of fortune felt very stuck like luck is on not on their side nothing good ever happens to them they are always stuck in weird situations also the sun is your card as i was saying so you are in this person's thoughts and the reason they can't stop thinking about you is because you look fine you are doing fine You could be dealing with fixed signs, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius. is that energy of resentment behaving like the wounded warrior focusing on that negative aspect on whatever happened in the past not being able to move forward they see you in a completely like sun nine of pentacles three of wands and bottom of the deck emperor could be dealing with an aries but damn they see you as this three of wands and the emperor
person. They had a choice to make between two people. They had a choice to make between two people. We did have the moon, right? So, as I said, this person could have put you in a third party situation. The three of cups and the moon was there. So, this person could have put you, yeah, two of wands. This options. This person had to choose between two people. Uh, this person could have been married to someone. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, but this person was married. And they had to make a choice. And this person did not choose you. Or you were the third person in this connection. And because the moon, I did see the moon there. This person could have lied to you about that. Kept that as a secret. This person could have had a whole secret family. You didn't know of. You weren't aware of. Also, oh, Ten of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune again, that 10, 10. There was definitely no balance in this connection with the star and the two of a Pentacles. There was no balance. This connection really lacked the balance. And it was probably because this person was already involved someplace else. very very attracted to you like uh, they like you brought something this kind of sorry this person saw something in you that they didn't find in someone else or see in someone else and this could be that free spiritedness adventure risk taking leo energy that you have this person was very very attracted to that now there's not much here to clarify but this person yes they're thinking about you are in the thoughts and why you're in the thoughts because you're the nine of pentacles you are looking fine as i said you brought something into this uh, you brought something to the table that or this connection that no one ever did and this person was they can't get over the fact that they can't have you they don't have you right now. They lost out on an opportunity with you. For some of you, we do have the Ten of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles here. So we do have the... Sorry, in the mix, we have the Eight of Pentacles, Ten and Two. So it's very possible for some of you, this person was very focused on their uh, uh, Pentacles, on their money, on their stability on building something and they weren't ready to settle down even if even they like financially this person wasn't doing well and they weren't ready or they weren't in a place to settle down to have that balance 444 to have that balance kind of connection they wanted this 10 of pentacles but they weren't in a place to give you that 10 of pentacles they weren't ready they were still struggling that sort of an energy The moon is again at the bottom of the deck yeah this person could have been going through some financial issues as well and they feel very insecure and not ready to not being able to give what you truly deserve and this is what really this is the reason why this connection didn't take off
we have the six and nine of pentacles so we have the three of pentacles in the mix here three of pentacles is this person thinks that you are you're getting a lot of attention the nine of pentacles is anyways the kind of person who gets a lot of attention six of pentacles is you as someone who is who is doing very well in life six of pentacles nine of pentacles mix in the mix we have the three of pentacles and this is how they see you three of wands so they see you as someone who's doing very well in life you you are sorted and that's what is making this person very very attracted towards you it's very possible for some of you this is the case of you being successful you being in a good position and this person feeling like they are not good enough for you and that is why this connection didn't take off this you is the sun the nine of pentacles the six of pentacles you you are the entire package almost Financially, you could be doing very well too, or you could be from a very good, very to do family or something, anything. You have your own money, you have generational wealth, what, whatever, whatever the case might be. And this person feels like, nah, they're not there yet. So they can't give you what they want, what, sorry, what you want. And that is why things aren't moving. It's very possible this person could be feeling resentful because of that too. Like they see you doing well, whereas they are struggling. the entire package and the moment i said that i thought i'm um, i don't know why the empress hasn't shown up yet and here we have the empress you could be dealing with a taurus or a libra but This is the reading of they see you as the empress and they feel like they can't match you yet. And that's why they're defensive. The defenses are up because you are the empress. No wonder you had these two beautiful cards for you. That's what I felt that that is your energy. And that totally is the energy of the empress. Whereas this person is, they feel miserable. They're not in a good place. They see you in a good place. The magician wanted to come out. This person is could also be defensive. The empress, they see you as the person, right? They see you as the person they want to end up with. Look at that. Seven of wands again at the bottom of the deck with the nine of wands. They feel very blocked from this connection. They feel very blocked from your energy. Like they can't get your energy. They can't be with you because you are completely in a totally different level than them. again their heart is blocked they are guarding their heart for some of you the reason this person is guarding their heart is because they are already in a connection with someone else hierophant and the empress the ten of pentacles showed up in the past this person could be married to someone else 
that's why they can't open up uh, to you they can't come towards you they can't offer you this ace of pentacles but yeah they they see a lot of happiness with you sun and the empress they see the possibility of great happiness with you you could definitely be dealing with a taurus here dealing with another Leo too we do have two sun cards but yeah this person sees you as their happiness they see the possibility of it but their heart is very very guarded because it's very possible they see you as this empress they can't match with your energy they see you not only as the empress they also see you as the hierophant so someone who's very spiritual someone who's very balanced someone who has sorted out pretty sorted Someone's also very happy and this spot this is totally the this is that energy right if I can pick up this card the sun is totally that free spirited adventurous risk taking energy so you are the sun and they feel nothing like the sun so how can they match you? others of you this uh, person is married to someone else and that is why they are guarded because they are still married to someone else so they, they are unable to offer you what you truly deserve at a distance with this person and they feel like your back is turned towards them just as i said that this is all very defensive energy they see you someone as someone who's very defensive towards them even if you might say that i am not but this person sees like you have blocked them for some of you you have really blocked them like look at that seven of wands six of swords this is like you blocking them with the four of pentacles you're holding back on purpose you're being stubborn on purpose you are fixed fire so this person sees you as your back is forever turned towards them not forever but your back is right now turned towards them there's no way you are letting them back in that is how they see you this is like extremely defensive energy Also, we have the seven of wands and the three of wands. So we have the four of wands in the mix. Four of wands is a very happy card. And with the three of wands and the four of wands, this person sees you as you focusing on your own happiness. And that is why you have blocked them because this person being, they don't add to your happiness. So you have blocked them. You're also trying to move on from them. And you are very guarded. Your heart is very guarded right now towards from this person because you don't trust them. did come out also we have the four of wands five of wands so do, we do have the ace of wands in the mix here queen of cups seven of cups the 
this person is confused they see the possibility of happiness with you with the four of wands and they they have emotions for you they have love for you with the queen of cups but the the thing is this person sees also a lot of drama with you five of wands there could have been a lot of drama between the both of you and this person isn't they just don't know how to deal with this they feel like if they come towards you there's going to be more drama there could be multiple people involved in this connection that is why this is a very very messy connection and that's why they find it difficult to be with you this king of wands came out with the seven of cups so they want to take that action. King of Wands is a fiery energy. The King of Wands is unapologetic and goes after what they want. They want to take this action, but with that Seven of Cups, they don't know. Seven of Cups, Five of Wands, this person could be really, really conflicted inside. A lot of confusion, a lot of conflictedness, a lot of back and forth going on. And we did have that back and forth with the Two of Pentacles here in the past energy. selfish one okay we have the page of wands pages are messengers and bottom of the deck we have knight of wands so yeah they, they are going to take action they are going to send you message but with the page of wands and the knight of wands this is that sensual energy they will come in towards you but this is very sexual energy page of wands and the knight of wands also not to mention this is a very flighty energy this is not a very stable energy at all this is the page of wands, knight of wands isn't the kind of person you trust and build something with. They have a lot of passion for you. I did mention at the beginning of the reading, right? The, uh, what did I say? The fire is still burning. That sort of a thing I said, right? So this person could be missing that intimate moments with you, bonding with you. Uh, they are missing that intimacy that sort of a thing and that is why this person might try to come back but yeah page of wands nine of wands that's not a very trustworthy energy For some of you this person might want to come towards you because they feel like just to test the waters if you have truly moved on or not But yeah, see Knight of Cups, they will come. But if you have the Empress and the Nine of Pentacles, this, this doesn't match. This is not your match. Alright. Well, that's your reading, Leo. I hope you found some clarity through this reading. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, take care guys. Bye-bye.